It's the middle of the night. You're standing on the bridge of a ship in the middle of the ocean when suddenly you spot what looks like the white cliffs of Dover coming towards you. This was the experience for those on the bridge of the QE2 in 1995 when the ship was hit by a massive wave estimated to be 95 feet or around 29 meters tall. That's a lot of water, which was described by Commodore Ron Warwick as looking like the white cliffs of Dover coming towards them. The ship dipped down into the trough before the wave crashed over the bow, with the water level reaching over the bridge windows and took the forward whistle mast away with it. Despite the weight and power of the water, the ship fared very well in the encounter. Remarkably, the majority of passengers slept through the entire event, only finding out about their lucky escape the next day when they woke up to find a certificate under the door congratulating them for surviving the ordeal.